Okay, so I just wanted to show y'all a really quick fun uh, trick with the shrink wrap modifier, kind of make it look like it's stretching around, um, you know, any kind of model you want. So I have this first, I got these three spheres, and then I joined them as just one object, hit control J on all three of them, another one thing, and then I added one big icosphere, so you can see it amongst these three, and I subdivided it uh, quite a bit. All right, so now you take your big object, the one you want to want it to wrap around, go to your modifiers, and shrink wrap. And then right here on target, that's where you select, in my case, the three balls that I made. All right, so you got this. Um, the first thing I always do is I hit offset of one. It just kind of, right now you can see it kind of cutting through the models. So you just bring it off, offset of one. And then on your icosphere, um, you're gonna wanna add a smoothing modifier. And then right here on repeat, just kind of bring it to where it can fix the rest with smooth shading right over here. So like right there, and that looks pretty good. Now you can see it kind of cutting through again. So go back to your um, shrink wrap modifier and hit another offset until it stops cutting through. And you have something pretty good. Last thing you wanna add is a wireframe and kind of bring down the thickness a good bit. And now, you got this thing that looks like it's stretching around your models. It looks pretty interesting. You can do all kind of you know weird abstract things with it. And then here's a little bonus. Um, if you have your tissue add-on selected, you go to your user preferences. It comes with the uh, it comes with Blender, so you go to go to your add-ons, and then right here on tissue, you just click dual mesh, and then I add a wireframe bring it down and then I add a subdivision surface and then now it kind of looks like some kind of goo or you know or you know whatever and it just looks pretty interesting and yeah that's that's um that's it pretty simple but it's fun you can do some pretty you know in visually interesting stuff with it so yeah thanks for watching